There was a woman who wanted to get married. But she wanted a very pious husband. So she said she'll marry the man with three conditions. Number one, he recites the whole Qur'an every single day. Number two, he should fast for the whole year. Number three, stay awake and worship Allah all throughout the night. She was a very beautiful woman, and a lot of suitors wanted to marry her. But they knew they couldn't fulfill the conditions she set. Until this one man stepped forward and said he could fulfill them. So the Imam got both of them married. The next day, the wife sees that the husband doesn't recite the whole of the Qur'an, nor does he fast, nor does he stay awake at night. She decided to let it roll on for a few weeks to see if there were any changes, but there weren't. So, she filed a complaint. They are both taken in front of the judge. The judge asked, what were the conditions of the marriage? The man replied, they were for me to recite the whole Qur'an daily, keep fast for the whole year, and to worship Allah all throughout the night. The judge asked, did you fulfill them? The man calmly answered, yes. The judge answers, your wife has said that you don't. The judge asked again, did you recite the full Quran every day? The man coolly answered, I recite Surah Ikhlas three times a day. And according to a hadith, reciting Surah Ikhlas three times is equivalent to reciting the whole Quran. Then the judge asked, how did you fast the whole year? The man answered, I fasted for the whole month of Ramadan, then kept another six fasts in the month of Shawwal. Prophet Muhammad wasallam said, Keeping all of the fasts of Ramadan, then keeping six fasts in the month of Shawwal, is as if you have fasted for the whole year. So the judge finally asked, How did you stay awake all night and worship Allah when your wife saw you sleeping? I prayed Salatul Isha with Jama'at, then the next day prayed Salatul Fajr with Jama'at. According to Prophet Muhammad wasallam, the one who prays Isha and Fajr with Jama'at is as if he stayed up all night worshipping Allah. The judge issued the final verdict. He said to the man and his wife, There is nothing wrong with this marriage.